everyone so this is going to be my quick review on the bath and body works pineapple water glow pedestal this holds the bath and body works three wick 14.5 ounce candles however you can put single wicks on here i'll try to put a picture of the pineapple pedestal that came out before but there was one that was more fully gold it didn't have the green leaves at the top and it was just slightly different and this was the tweak that came out during the summer collection if you were lucky enough to score this for $4.95 I'm not sure why, but some of the water glow pedestals went down to that price, which is insane because the retail price of this lists $74.95. So that's more than 75% off. I'm going to give you some of the reasons why I like this and some of the reasons why I don't. So let me go over the first reason why I don't really like the water glow pedestals from Bath & Body Works. And the reason being is that they use typically three AA batteries and I feel like that just wastes the battery so quickly. A fix for this would be to get rechargeable batteries, but if you use this water glow pedestal every day for hours on end, um, it's really easy to use this up. I'm not sure why if I feel like there's like children's toys that last longer than that but worker even told me at a bath and body works that if they leave the water glow pedestals running the entire day that towards the end they need to replace the battery i feel like a solution would be to have a power cord option that you can plug into an outlet or to use the batteries in this that just gives more variety and i feel like that would be better no it would be kind of bulky but at least for the people who just keep this in one place and don't really move it around that'd be a lot better than to having to change these batteries every single day it's kind of a way so if you have this on for eight hours a day and let's say for an entire week you would use up 21 batteries if you're not using a rechargeable battery so that's the downside another downside that i don't like about this it might be like a pro and a con is that this isn't glass i feel like the water glow pedestals that i remember i could have sworn that they were glass at one point kind of makes it feel a little bit cheap it makes this a lot lighter but i don't know i kind of like the glass look a little bit more also another thing that i find is that this top part where you set the candle is very easy to scuff up i've only set maybe about two candles on here and i don't know if you can tell right here it's easy to get like smudges and scratches so you really need to be careful that's another thing that i feel like it's kind of a con I'm going to go ahead and show you how it looks like turned on. Okay, so since I've been moving this around a little bit, the glitter has been kind of mixed up. I'm not sure if you're going to be able to see it, but the glitter starts at the bottom condensed and then it goes all around. So there we go. It's super pretty, super nice. And I feel like compared to some of the other water glow pedestals, this one isn't the loudest that I've had. I'm going to go ahead and move this to a darker place so you can see it a little bit better. Okay, I don't know if you could pick this up, but essentially the water globe is spinning. The glitters are circling around, but the light is really dim. I think because I need to replace the batteries, but yeah, that's a con. And if I get really close, I think you can almost hear the sound of the humming. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and replace the batteries and then show you how it looks like towards the end of its life, which is right now because of the batteries and how it looks like with some brand new batteries. Okay, I have replaced the batteries, so you should notice a difference in the level of brightness. I'm going to go ahead and turn this on. <laughs> So yeah, that's definitely a lot brighter. However, I do notice that the motor is slightly louder once the light is brighter. Here's how it looks like further out. So while it is a nice piece, I definitely don't believe that it's worth paying full price for this. So I just wanted to give my opinions and my thoughts about the water glow pedestals, the Bath & Body Works, some pros and cons. And definitely the pros is that they're really beautiful. They're very pretty. And some of them are even more intricate than this one. However, I bought this one because one, the price, and then two, I could use this year round. Yeah, so just know that going into it that these can be loud. Some designs more than the others. And then towards the end of its battery life, there won't be any light. What typically happens is that the light gets very dim, but the motor still spins. <laughs> All right, thank you so much for watching this quick review and have a great day. Okay, bye.